I thought it was helping me fill time in a positive way, which sounds horrible to say out loud right now. <laughs> As you went through this process, and like you said about the virtuous cycle, that one very important decision led to other things. Can you share some of those other things that kept you going in the right direction? Certainly. Um, so I think uh, when I was when I was using alcohol, I you know it was I thought it was helping me fill time in a in a, in a positive way, which sounds horrible to say out loud right now. <laughs> um, and as those of us who are going through this journey know and could come out the other side and begin this virtuous cycle, it's the exact opposite. So when you eliminate that and it opens your mind and your time to other things, that's when the virtuous cycle begins. So at first for me, there were, um, I guess I'll say more simple, but very important things that started that cycle. So noticing that I was a better listener, had more mental capacity to spend on things that were worth thinking about and I needed to think about. Um, being able to have more energy for, you know, physical workouts and improving mm -hmm. my physical health and mental health. My anxiety, you know, now is almost gone, um, which is saying a lot for me. Um, yeah. And my confidence level went up. So all of those things then feed in to wanting to, you know, commit in an even um, more committed way to an alcohol-free lifestyle. So that, that's what I'll call kind of the first stage, the things that you may notice quickly. And then I connected my P90 experience, and we talk about this, uh, as you know very well as a coach, Victoria, uh, with wanting to use all of this newfound energy and time to connecting back to my community. So my community of my family community, um, my community with my children and their school, my parental community and other, you know, parents and friends that I had, you know, not seen in a long time because here I am sitting on the couch doing whatever, drinking, thinking I was, you know, accomplishing something. And then for me, my spiritual community, and you and I have talked about that. Mm -hmm. um, I happen to be a person of, of faith, but spiritual can mean anything you want. There, there's a huge spectrum on there. But you, you then, you know, without alcohol, have that time and mental capacity to reconnect with your spiritual side. Mm -hmm. And it's the joining of those communities, Victoria, that really started the major virtuous cycle in my life because that is so rewarding personally. And then you're giving back. Yes. And, um, you know, giving back to your community, uh, giving back to you know, being a productive member of society, you know, your little village around you mm -hmm. is extremely rewarding. And, um, that's the virtuous cycle that I now find myself in. 